Hey guys, it's Slavery666 and I'm back after a oh. Yeah, just a little bit of cobblestones left. See? It's just those two blocks. I took the rest. Anyways, I made quite a few little new areas. This is the uh storage closet. Kitchens you guys have already seen. I just added a little picture there, I think. It's been a while. And I closed the door on myself. Okay, and you may notice this. It's the pond. Yes. Let's just ta say it took me a while, and buckets are very, very useful. I just came in here, so let me see if it's nice. Just have it in here. Uh, nope. I get so lost. I don't know where everything is now, because I have so much storage. There it is. This is my stuff before I went into the nether. I made the pond most likely mostly because I like doing this and not having a snake on the bottom. Just a little fishing calms the nerves. Get something from my little cauldron right over here, as you can see. And yes, you do not want to know what that is, right? Like right there. Yeah, let's just say it involves wolves and their meat. This is better than Wolf's Mod. Definitely has some screwed up parts to it. And as you can see, I'm using the old, old uh, texture pack I had. But, anyways. Tonight, since I've turned my farm, my portal into storage, I just thought, hey, you know what? Let's make our own little farm. Yeah! Just walk down the hall. It's freakishly close. And I have one piece of obsidian from an ogre. Flint and steel. Anyways, uh, get that back in. Uh, I'm still searching for a pick. I need a pick. You know, I should really just... Oh, wait, I do. I'm an idiot. Ow. Leg. And just take one more of those. Uh, yeah. No, yeah, yeah. And two more of these. Because you'll see what it'll do in a second. Anyways, I'm going to stack these up. Leave three across and two there. Get a stone pickaxe. And I get a hoe. Sup my hoe. Mies. Horrible pun. Anyways, I built myself an incinerator that from the lab I've got for the nether. Nice and warm. I say that because it is true. It is nice and warm. Anyways, turn this. And I've been hearing some zombie noises. And some scary noises. Sweet, that's already mined for me. Forgot it. Okay. What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck was that? I heard like a lion attacking sound. Where the fuck is everything? Okay. Okay, calm down, Mitchell. Calm down. Oops. Uh, you didn't hear anything. That is not my real name. Okay, it is, but just calm down. Uh, anyways. So, I'm going to be building this farm. And this farm is going to be epic. Huh. And, yeah. The outside's been looking pretty good, so I thought inside could do an improvement. Huh. Make a little water trough down the middle. And then mine out the sides. Make a little there. I only need every second side. Huh. I was not thinking there, because I need torches in between both of them. 
Misplaced cobblestone makes me sad face. Anyways, now it is time to get some torches. Of course, I lost most of my torches having to commit suicide. That wall's gonna get annoying. Yeah. So just replace that. And, uh, let's see. Put this back. And what did I come out here for? Give me a minute. Uh, that. And, uh, wow. I have a little too much storage chests now. And is it in here? Well, I have to take some from the furnace. Yeah, I have to take some from the furnace. Oh yeah, and I found some iron. So we're gonna make ourselves a crossbow. Cause crossbows are epic. If we've never seen a crossbow, GTFO. Just GTFO. <laughs> now. Just kidding. You guys can stay. Because you guys are epic like that. You guys can stay. Anyways. Just head down. Scary noises. Well, freaky noises. They don't exactly scare me. So let's just... Uh, I'm not going to use every second one now because I just thought of a idea that I could have done a while ago, but never really bothered to. Because I was being an idiot. All the warmth and growth of the sun, but inside, with a billion torches. And we're going to need a door for that and a bucket to get the water and daytime to get the water so yeah I think I'll just cut back when this is finished anyways see you then hey guys this is livery666 and I'm back anyways I got the farm going and if you can't hear in the background I actually <coughs> excuse me have the portal working. But a uh, little has changed. I decided I got. Ooh, iron. What's that doing to my roof? Anyways, I have too much iron to be in with. I've been exploring and I found a cave that was full of it. All the way to somewhere over there. You could see what I was working on when I went through that one portal, at least. My tower. My big ass tower. It's pretty large. I know. And don't take that as a sexual innuendo. <laughs> Boom. But, uh, anyways, this is my little house, and this is where I came through on the portal. I know, it's kind of weird. It's a little small area. And I just started building all around it. Built a little house on, wa on water. But don't worry, it's not too faulty. There's at least little beams, support beams underneath. Hope you guys seen that. You probably couldn't, but, anyways travel up and up and I put some windows here so you don't in complete darkness and then there's two floors up here there is one floor well actually there's three floors truth be told there's one floor the workroom and then the second floor the viewing room first time I poofed here I didn't think my house was so close I just kept looking that way and I'm like oh god where the hell am I kept committing suicide right there with the sand. Little did I know my house was like right over there in the distance. And then there's the third floor. 
which is probably my favorite. It's a little viewing floor that I've turned in. This is the s first time coming through the portal. This, uh, down there was the second time. Anyways, this is the first time. So I've turned this little place into just a tiny altar. Pray, you know. Pray to my gods. Even though I don't know what they are. But, uh, yeah. And... I've made it so you can't really suicide on top. It's really hard to, but you still probably can if you really tried. Plus, this is kind of cool. You can watch the land burn. That's my favorite activity. Just watching the land burst into flames because they have another rock right there. Ha! <laughs> I've also. Anyways, you can imagine how much cobblestone that took. And if you didn't know, a lot. Just a lot. I'm not gonna say any more. Cause that's all I know. It was a lot. And a lot. And a lot. And fifty more a lots of coal. And as you can see that area is filled in differently. It's because I had a little problem. There was some fire wraiths and a zombie stuck in there for a while, so I just started killing them. You guys should have seen me when I first came back into this place after discovering my tower. Just, the apparently this area right here was so dark that a zombie spawned in it. And I'm just walking in like this, basically. Just open up the door. Open up the door, look for a quick second, turn back, and then look at behind me and the zombie's right there. <laughs> it was kind of like a stupid experience. Like, I didn't even notice it for the first little bit. Then I'm like, oh, shit, he's right there. Anyways, I had lava in the I tried to kill a fire race with lava. Bad idea. Anyways, so when I opened it, it spread to the water, and yeah. And I got a lot of cobblestone to mine. I just can't light half stone, half block on fire, and I just waste a lot of durability on that. And then my shark pool, obviously. Gotta fall into it every once in a while. Thank god they aren't aggressive. Eh, eh. Light. Yes. Light. Come on. Light. Yes. Three slots. Ching 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 <laughs> Just cash starts flowing out the bottom instead of water. Yes. Lit on fire. Cause I'm epic like that. I could possibly light this tree on fire, but I'm not. So I'm gonna go find a different tree and light it on fire. I want the hellish look from the tree. And then I'll chop that tree down. End!